So here we go, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Heron and Dama. A defensive battle with three different locations to defend a bridge, the uh, runway kind of service area, and a little village. So I have no idea what I'm going to do first. Time to start making stuff up. I think this is clearly going to be a location that we're going to have to take. This is going to be a location that we're going to have to hold. In fact, I'm going to send an anti-tank gun right here. And do I have an engineer I can send there as well? Yes, I do. And I think we'll throw an anti-aircraft gun back here a little bit. Okay, the central location. They are going to come, well, <laughs> I hope from that direction. I think I'm going to put a Tiger tank right here. The one Tiger that we have. And... That's spoken for. That needs to get over here pretty quick. And that can go... Okay, so I'm thinking as I go here, I'm hoping this central location is going to be the center of the fight. I really don't know if it will or won't be, but we'll find out. The BA-10 can come back here. And what else do we have? We have an anti-tank gun. A flat gun. I think I'm going to get bombed at some point, so I'm going to put the flat gun here. Okay, these guys are going to do a little bit of trench digging. I'll sandbags at first. Change mind, I'm not going to do that at all. We'll put some barbed wire across there. Okay, a support element. Gosh, I really don't know what to do. Um, Tell him to dig a trench back here. He's going to dig some low sandbags to go across there like that. That's an anti-aircraft gun, and maybe I've pushed that too far forward. That's the anti-tank gun that I want right there. I'm hoping these guys can do a lot of damage. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Tiger tank is going to start leveling this area. Again, I'm manually driving it to get what I need done because they don't drive across buildings exactly as precisely as I would like. I'm 
and go and knock down those buildings in the centre, then park back here by these two trees. Fortunately, the big old tiger is heavy enough to knock down these buildings. Some of the lighter tanks can't do that. While I'm up here, I'll take down this little wooden shack. And then back up into a fire zone. Trying to be as quick and efficient as I can because I'm wasting time here doing this. I could be doing other things. Alright, and I'll park this guy here and put in a trench behind him. A tank. Um, emplacement is the right word. And this guy is going to get off and I'm going to use him to place down some barbed wire. Whoops. Click on him. Okay, so I can't have that working for me now. I'm going to move some infantry, tank crews. Okay, so these guys are in contact. I want this guy to place a couple of Tank traps right there. BT-7 should be able to take that and track it. guys use their sandbags what little cover they do have good kill that tank and these guys are doing their thing up here I've really done much very effective I wonder if I can get him to dig a couple of tank traps. At least one tank trap back there like that. These guys are doing surprisingly well. I'm uh, pretty impressed with that. I'm calling the infantry now. Okay, he's busy up there. Those guys are probably not in the best spot, but I can't micromanage as much as I want.
Okay, so over here is still a bit of a fight. We need to back this up with some infantry, I think. And I'm going to have to send a uh, Panzer crew over here and the infantry crew over here. Efficiency of four, so I'm really doing kind of well here. Although I'm not holding the flag, I've got to get some infantry onto that flag when they get up here. But um, I got these guys here because I anticipate that the um, aircraft will fly to this point before it disperses. Um, Trench back here. Okay, these guys can. Tiger's doing well in the middle. It's a good job I cleared those buildings down. I'm going to start moving the infantry section to here. So they can support this tank. We've got a dead engineer up there, so kind of have to nurse these engineers a little bit. I'm down to just two. And it's not looking good. Well, I'm going to send the other tank crew, which is over there. That's not what I want. medics over here to fuel these guys up. The tank off to this side that I'm worried about. It's a uh, T-34, so I'm going to have to move the big tank up there. As soon as I get some infantry here to support this section. Oh boy. Looking kind of dodgy. A little bit more stressful than I hoped for. Flame tank, come on guys, slaughter them.
Ah, damn. That's the exact opposite of what I wanted. Okay, time for this tiger to move up here and flank that guy and kill him. It's a bit sneaky, see if it works. Yep, blew it up. <laughs> well, lucky there. Shift R, Panzer Crew can fix that. Shift R. Fix that. And my tiger is getting swamped. Now we can move. Move. Wow, I'm getting uh, kind of swamped here. You know, I stopped talking when I uh, feeling feeling overwhelmed. Shift R. These guys better repair this thing pretty quick. He's repairing that. He's engineers pulling security on a dead tank. <laughs> um, shift R. That's not repairable for some reason. Okay. If there's any spare parts in here. Nope, nothing. And I want spare parts in here maybe. toolkit he should be able to repair this but he can oh I'll let him get into here
Wow. This is getting kind of close. Come on, kill it, kill it, kill it. I need my other medic over here. And my ammunition box over here. Come on, guys, you can do it. We believe in you. Kill that freaking armored car. Do I have to tell you guys to do the right thing? Better control of it. Kill it. Kill it. Come on. And we win. Short but sweet. 23 minutes later. Oof. Okay, so you can go back there. Now I need to mop up the defenders. <laughs> okay, that was kind of goofy. I know there's Russians hiding off over here. Is that guy dead under the tank? Can't quite tell. Well, it's not a tank, sorry, it's a... Uh, a Skids of 10 with a 5 centimeter pack on it. If he'd faced the right way, I'd be really happy. Come on, hunt them down. Don't get too close where the infantry can kill you. So here we have the collected loot. T60, which is uh, actually two T60s, which are pretty good because we've got that 20 millimeter uh, automatic cannon on there. Sadly, I can't use it. It's a tank. BT-7, some other stuff here. Um, so let's see how we did. Let's uh, finish the game out. Not bad for a defensive campaign battle. I was a little bit uh, squirrely as I was trying to keep up with three different objectives. This would be much better if I rope one of my mates into playing with me. And here we get five more uh, resource points, so I'm pretty happy with that. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I know I did. Love and hugs. Peace out. 
If you enjoy this content please hit the like button and subscribe. Additionally you can leave a comment, that lets Saxon know what you think and if you enjoyed this type of content. Thanks, for watching.